The second animal in the Chinese zodiac is the ox, who represents diligence and stability. Among the twelve signs, the ox stands in sharp contrast to the rat as the biggest in size. Therefore, people equate the rat with the notion of smallness or having less, while the ox is associated with immensity and having more. People born in the year of the ox tend to cherish ideals and ambitions. They do things according to their own will and ability, hold strong to their beliefs, and attach great importance to work and family. Experiencing above average luck and opportunities as teenagers, they will leave home to start from scratch at an early age. It is only in midlife that they will endure hardship and a loss of faith. But happiness will return to them in old age. Ox people are mild, honest, patient, diligent, independent, enthusiastic, and firm. At the same time, they can be stubborn and a bit unsociable. Their most obvious merits are marked by a strong sense of responsibility in a down-to-earth manner and thorough consideration before they make a decision on anything. And once they have made a decision, they would courageously carry it out and try to overcome any adversity. Born with a sense of righteousness, ox people are stubborn, conservative, and faithful to traditions. However, it is beneficial for them to give up their own views and try to be adaptable when faced with temporary upheavals. Ox people are hardworking, diligent. They are stable characters and a fairly strong ability to deliberate makes them suitable for analytical work and anything related to professional techniques and knowledge. Hence, enjoying smooth success in their career development. They need to be mindful of envious people who will cause trouble and learn to be adaptable in order to overcome adversity. Though they have a tendency to be sentimental, the ox knows whom to love and whom to hate. It is a pity their good luck tends to disappear due to their lack of ability to show themselves and take initiative to connect with other people. In spite of this, their honesty deserves praise. They will be with the right people if they are always honest. Besides another, uh, besides this point. Ox are suited to be matched with those of the rat, the snake, and the roaster. There will be quick disagreements if they are matched with those of the horse, the sheep, and the dragon, and lastly the dog. Hence, requiring adjustments for balance and happiness. But ultimately, the date of birth or the day master or Ruzu must be taken into account when determining relationship compatibility. People born in the ox year are diligent and courageous with relatively modest wealth. Because of their lack of personal financial acumen, they will not enjoy great wealth but instead enjoy a stable life with a decent amount in savings. For the ox born in the first lunar month, Good luck will be scarce in the early years. Opportunities come in the middle age, and happiness and longevity will be enjoyed in old age. Self-reliance will yield pros- prosperity. Those born in the second lunar month, courageous actions done with the desire for amazing career achievements will have con- counterproductive results. Born in the third lunar month. Very smart and knowledgeable, and without much effort, they will enjoy a pleasant and very free life. When they are away from home, respect will be earned. Those born in the fourth lunar month, without the ability to hold a high position in society, opportunities and wealth will be average. Those born in the fifth lunar month, though kind-hearted and devoted to parents. The lack of help from influential people will hamper、uh, the ability to make much money. Those born in the sixth lunar month with outstanding intelligence, working hard in the early years will gradually lead to prosperity after middle age. Benefactors will help them, 
there will be less external resistance and more good luck. Those born in the seventh lunar month, smart and intelligent, a healthy life will be enjoyed with no serious disasters or illnesses. Old age will be a long and happy one. For those born in the eighth lunar month, being healthy, smart, and flexible, they will enjoy both wealth and fame. Those born in the ninth lunar month, blessed with intelligence and a good work ethic, along with courage and intuition, notice and help from benefactors, they will have an outstanding career and supremely full life. Those born in the tenth lunar month, early years will be in poverty. But prosperity will come in youth or middle age. Smart and resolute, achievements will be noted. Wealth will be enjoyed as a result of extremely clever business acumen. Those born in the eleventh lunar month, setbacks will be encountered often without much help from benefactors. For the old that are born in the twelfth lunar month, despite enjoying great family life and having great Ambitions and energy, fame will always be achieved without much wealth. But ultimately, the date and time of birth will be the greatest factors to be considered when examining the individual's life.